I got popcorn. It's four in the morning. I don't know what I want to make. Let's play some Pyre. I, I think it's it sold well, but I think a majority of people don't know this game exists. You hear that? Oh, that's the party cart right there. Your days on the downside brought slow, lonesome agony. Now, as you lie yielding to the elements, something rumbles into view. Three shapes emerge, each clad in strange attire. You told us we would find someone alive. Someone I said we'd find someday. I said we'd find someone alive someday. Just not today, I guess. But don't be glum. You know I see you frowning under that mask. The masked wanderers presume you are female. Hmm. Yeah, let's... You know what? Let's go with there. Let's make this fun. Also, give me one more second, sorry. Broken, shaking, starving, probably diseased. Yeah, good luck with that there, chum. See you back at the wagon. Ah, uh, finally someone's come to save me. Oh, you're dirty. We can't let you on our cart. This is the party cart. Understood. I won't be long. After the others leave, the man turns towards you and begins unfastening his mask. You are parched, and he gives you a drink. I'm back. And with a guest. She loosened the clasps on her mask. She's a muscled horned woman. Enough said. Ah, oh, my boy! My fucking boy! Look at him! It's my boy! I fucking love these. Hey, chum. Nice meeting you all, but tell me something. You know how to read or what? It's why you got sent to jail in the first place. I kind of just picture it now. You are banned from this universe due to your ability of reading. No, no, I swear I only use Audible. Well then, glory days, because it just so happens my associates and I, we got ourselves some nice material for someone just like you. <laughs> Welcome to Hearthstone. Well, friend, what does it say? But when your vision starts to fade and blur, you feel your body weaken and give out. All this reading got my constitution all loopy. Witness the right. Give yourself unto the thesaurus. Is this why reading is illegal? I is this the reason? Because, you know, this is a very fair reason. Reader, we aim to free ourselves. We will not grow old and die in the downside. And now I swear to you... When we get out of here, you're going to come with us, but first, we need your help. Show us the way. The three must act as one. We're all in this together. This is basically very complicated, nerdy fantasy uh, basketball, and I love it. Uh, Jodariel? Jodariel? I'm going to call her Jody. Leads you outside where a clear night sky awaits. Now show us, before the Howlers catch our scent, well shall the rites commence. Seek out the destination! Hello! According to the stars, the fossil remains of the serpent titan slain by Gull, Goliath... Gola... Gola... Golathanian? Hmm. Great, and we're supposed to be there when exactly? Very soon, according to the stars, you should be able to arrive in time if you make haste. <laughs> well, this ought to be good for a few laughs, at least. What do you say, Jody? Jodariel turns to you, studying you. Reader, do not deceive us. Pray we make good use of our remaining time. What she means is, glad to have you aboard, chum. Reading Rainbow Basketball, here we go! Woo! It only gets less hospitable as you press further north. Well, this road trip's just gonna be a big delight, ain't it? Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him! I want a plushie of him! The southern route to the Ridge of Gaul goes through a humid area pocked with hot springs. 
Runoff from the sandfolds means no bathing in the springs. They're just here to mock you. <laughs> Damn you, mock you! <laughs> just like, you just roll by the hot spring. It's just like, oh, we're so comforting. Don't you just want to bathe in us? The plain parcel! Certain types of luxury goods somehow find their way down to the downside. This can be sold at the slug market. Mmm, mysteries upon mysteries. Good thing I have popcorn to keep me company. Um, surely we could have procured some sort of rare fungus had we gone the other way. Uh, as much as I love the idea of procuring rare fungus there, Jody, we said we wouldn't go around second-guessing our good chum's decisions, right? <laughs> Jodariel says nothing in response, but soon changes the subject. She's muscly, and she's Sundere. How could I not love her? You observe the man slumped in the corner of the wagon, bearing some sort of stinged instrument. You sense he lives, but nothing more. It seems in inopportune to ask about him now. <laughs> don't, don't mind me, the lone minstrel in the corner. Nothing here needs to be worrisome. I'm just here, minding my own business. Might even be a corpse rotting away. You'll never know, and I'll never tell. The first exile, in the words of Gaul, Golathanian, the Master General. You know, perhaps the thrice cursed name of Solium Mur, the Emperor of Sar, the first exile, and my liege. The chapter concerns him and those who found him in the downside. Each of us was sent to take his life. Such was the hatred for him and around his country. Yet we found in Solium Mur a man. Transformed in body, mind, and spirit, a man deserving of much more than mercy. In time, he named us all the, his scribes, and he became the eighth. It is to my greatest honor now to share with you his deeds. To know his story is to know the rights. We'll get more as time goes on. Okay, Drive Imp. I love it. So the Drive Imps, they, they'll explain it later, but they're the ones that get this thing going, and they are just the best. Look at them. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. I wish I may. I wish I might. Play a dumbass basketball game all through the night. Be still. We have visitor. I see that the reports of your demise have been exaggerated after all. Even I was beginning to think you were gone for good. Surprised to see old Lindell again. Dramatic reverb. I trust you remember my face, though you must have assumed never to see it again after last time. Never had I come so close to freedom only for you to dash my hopes. Now I can- now I and the accusers, accusers shall repay that affront. Listen, I have a bit of dyslexia. I have to read my own script, dammit. This is exactly what you've done to me. Uh. First point! Yeah, probably. Boop! Hup! Hup! Come on, I fucking dare you guys! Let's go! Ha ha ha! Big woman power! Hear me, accusers! Stand your ground! Let your auras boil in rage! Have you any idea what that Lendl did to you deserve his exile? Mm -hmm. yeah. Ah! It's fine. Because watch this. Comes for the dunk! Woo! Prevailed. <laughs> Rejoice then in your single fleeting victory. Listen, this is what happens when the referee does not like the team he has to work for. We'll live with it. Your deceit may have earned you a hollow victory, but know this. The accusers will not forget your wickedness. And next we meet, you will rue the day. 
After using her rush to lunge forward, Jordiel can rush again right away. Or after banishing an adversary, Jordiel instantly recovers all her stamina. I like that one more. And that's Pyre, guys! Like, that's what it's like to play Pyre. It's stupid fun, and you get to know more about your characters, and ah! The getting out of here, club. Next up on the agenda, keep chasing stars until we're free. Until we are free. Until we're free. Here, here! Sounds fine. Might as well be us instead of Lendell back there. Anyway, guess we better start packing. As the others go about their business, Hedman turns to you. Leader, come walk with me. All the stars are still out. You and Hedwin walk in this silence for a time before he speaks up. You have questions. Come ask away. We need you in this for the long haul. Why he was exiled? Good question. We're going to have a lot of time to discuss that and many other things. I'll make you a deal. Read the stars for us again, and I'll tell you about it on the way. You sense he speaks truly as he beckons toward the fading dark above. Time to seek out the next destination. We're going to... Holy shit! Imps fed, wheels clean. Status Jody. No signs of howlers. Everything is secure. Good. Then get some rest. We're headed to the Spring of Jamor.